Hello everyone. As we already know that video link 89 is Pro, 89, 89S, 8010, 2 and TAFB can connect to DBS Crossfire. Our service transmitters can also connect to DBS Crossfire. This tutorial applies to all service transmitters such as RC6GS, RC6GS V2, RC4GS, RC4GS V2. I'm going to introduce how to connect RC6GS V2 with TBS Crossfire. For our service transmitters, there is a simulator port called DSC. It supports PPM signal output. TBS Crossfire supports PPM signal input. First, connect TBS Crossfire to a transmitter. There are some cables in the package when you buy TPS Crossfire. This cable. Plug one end to RC input. And plug the other end to DSC of the transmitter. the simulator port. Power on the transmitter. And power on TPS crossfire. Second, set the data on TBS Crossfire. Long press the button to enter the menu, RX Nano, Output Map. Output 1 should be sparse. Sparse here means the signal output of the receiver because our flight controller can recognize sparse or PPM signal. If you want to run a car model, you may need a receiver which supports PWM signal. Please note to set mode to 12 channels if you use flight controller because if you set it to 8 channels, the receiver will only support 8 channel signal output. Third, test with Minipix emission planner in order to show the server display. Let's take mini pigs as an example. Connect mini pigs to a computer with a USB cable. The light of the receiver and TBS crossfire turned green because I've already finished bending. For more details of bending, please check the instruction manual of TBS crossfire. Now let's connect. Please choose the right COM port and board read and then collect. Collection succeeds. Click hardware config. Radio calibration. Calibrate radio. OK. Push the throttle. There is a bar movement emission planner. Turn the steering and there is movement two, which means there is successful signal output by TBS crossfire. And push all the switches and calibrate them. Mm -hmm. 
after the calibration is complete. Click when done. OK. And that's all about how to connect RC6 GSV2 with TBS Crossfire. Thank you.